Hey everyone, welcome to TechWired. In this video, we are going to see leak code number problem number 21, merge two sorted list. So we are giving we are given uh, two uh, linked lists and we need to uh, merge these two linked lists and both of the linked lists are given in sorted order and there can be duplicate values. So, so we are going to see the logic and the code in Python. Now let's dive into the solution. So this is the first example that is given in the problem. So we will see how to so how to merge these two linked lists. So first we will merge, we will join the list number one to a dummy node. Assume the dummy node is minus one. Here we will join the list one. Okay, so I will be having one, two, and four. Okay, this will be my first thing to do. Why we are doing? Because we know our list are sorted right our lists are sorted what we are going to do is we are going to just append each node in list 2 to this newly created node in between we are just going to join in between this new node okay we are just going to join each node in list 2 in between the the new node that has been created using the dummy node okay so this is the new node and then this is the list of two node this to two linked list okay so first i will be having a pointer previous in order to maintain the previous nodes okay now i will be having corresponding n1 n2 pointers for both the list linked list 1 and linked list 2 okay we will, we will see the condi condition for uh, when my node in my newly created list the dummy node list if a node is greater than or equal to to the node in l2 okay now we will see the logic for those for this particular condition so first now we can see now the value the node value in n1 and n2 are equal here 1 1 so in this case i just have to join here right we just have to join straight away so what i'm going to do is i'm going to keep temp another pointer as temp here now i'm going to join the previous node and the current n2 these two okay now i will be having minus one and one and another one here okay this is a previous pointer this is n2 this is n1 we are just joining the one node first okay now i will update my pointers now previous will become this okay then n2 n2 will be here this one that's why we created a new pointer temp we will just put temp n2 is equal to temp okay now this is the updated list we can we could see the pointers has been updated okay now the n2 value is greater than my n1 the next condition here we are not going to do anything we are just going to update our previous and n1 pointer in this scenario 
so here my previous will be this one and n1 will be 2 so the loop is going to go again now it's n2 again n2 is greater than n n1 so we are just going to update again this is going to be my previous and this is going to be my n1 okay so when it's greater than or equal to we are just going to append we are just going to join each node in this particular new created list okay then we are going to return this uh, dummy dot next from here we will be returning okay when we reach an end node there is a con uh, base condition okay there is an edge case So when we reach the end of the newly created list and assume we still left with some nodes in N2 to iterate, we don't have to iterate. Since we know it's a sorted list, we can just join straight away and then we can just break the loop and we can just return it. I'm going to show that in code. It will be easy to understand for you guys. So first we will see. What if there is no nodes in our list one and list two? Okay, first we will write a condition, base conditions for that one. If there is no list one, we are just going to return list two. If there is no list two, then we will just return list one. Okay, now I'm going to create a dummy node where I'm just pointing dummy is equal to previous. I'm creating a node now. A new node called minus one, and I'm going to join my first list list one okay now i'm going to create n1 is equal to list one n2 is equal to list two i'm just pointing the like a header okay now i'm going to write a loop i will run this loop until n1 and n2 exist So first we'll see if there if n2 value is greater than strictly greater than n1 value okay we will we will only update n1 and previous pointers as simple as that we will keep we will keep previous as n1 and n1 is equal to n1 dot next so there is a base case here if we reach the end of the node the first the newly created dummy node list okay so we will check that one when we reach n1 when that when we reach the last node we don't have to iterate further we just can break we can just join since we know it's sorted we can just join n1 dot next is equal to n2 okay we can just break this particular loop okay we don't have to join further so when it's greater than when it's less than equal to when n2 values are less than equal to we will create a temporary pointer and we update our dummy node list with joining each node in list 2 okay 
that's what I'm just join okay previous is equal to n2 and n2 is equal to that that I am stored in the temporary point now I'm going to just return the dummy dot next okay as you guys see it's pretty much efficient so thank you for watching the video please like and subscribe if you guys have any particular problem with solving these types of problems please mention those particular problems in the comment section i will be happy to answer those questions and i will try to solve those questions as well in the upcoming videos and keep supporting happy learning cheers